Welcome to Jamaica, and welcome to the best golf course in the Caribbean, White Witch. Over the next few minutes, I'm going to take you on a virtual tour of this award-winning course designed through and around 600 acres of stunning land that opens its arms to golfers of all abilities. But first, a little local lore. The name for the course, White Witch, comes from the 19th century mistress of Rose Hall, Annie Palmer, who cruelly abused her slaves and dispatched three successive husbands. Here at White Witch, elevation change is, well, something you're gonna have to deal with. Number one is a par five, and you might not wanna hit your driver. Number two, look at this, I'm playing that out about 168 yards, but I have so much of a drop off, I don't know which club to use. The designers at White Witch used the stunning vistas through the entire 18 holes. When you tee it up at a Caribbean golf course, you're usually going to see flat terrain and some palm trees, so you might be a little surprised with the non-tropical setting at White Witch. The mountain terrain, winds coming off the blue waters, and lots of rich, lush foliage are with you on every hole. So are the views of the beautiful Caribbean Sea. 16 of 18 holes have those views that will cause you to pause and grab into the bag for the camera. You know, every once in a while, I get an opportunity to be able to go to a resort like this at White Witch, and you know, the resort is so much better than the pictures you see in the magazine. This is just as spectacular as it gets. Number one, par five at White Witch. This track is truly alluring, not only for its jaw-dropping beauty, but for its playability. A single-digit handicap could play alongside a player of lesser ability with both having a great time. Remember, always pick the correct tees for your game and make sure that you have the right club in your hand. At White Witch, well, when the trade winds are coming at you, that shot that earlier might have been an easy eight, well, it's turned into a hard five in the afternoon. The par threes here at White Witch are spectacular. Again, you see exactly where you need to place the ball as you tee it up. Pick the right club, make a solid swing, and you'll be putting for a birdie. The biggest problem you might have is to slow your heart rate. Oh, these holes are stunning to the eye. One of the true tests of a great course is, are all the holes the same, or do they stand on their own? Here at White Witch, when you walk off the course after playing the full 18, you can remember every hole. That's because they are so distinct. No two are alike, and each gives you unmatched visual overall greens, receptive to your approach shots. And while the terrain looks a little wild and rugged, it's easily tamed with a solid shot. You can score the White Witch. This is a top shelf property with all the ingredients to keep you intrigued throughout the entire 18 holes. You'll go from the top of the mountain into ravines, cross hollows, onto greens that roll straight. And yes, there is some undulation once you get onto that putting surface, but they are true. There is bunkering throughout the course, but once again, the architects made sure that they were not injurious to your round. An errant shot can find them, but you can always blame it on the original white witch, Annie Palmer. I think Annie Palmer got me on that one. Well, there you have it, a virtual tour of one of the best courses in the Caribbean, White Witch at Rose Hall. Come on over and enjoy a great experience.